Miss Siegler, from what year to what year did you and Mr. Atkinson live together? I'm not sure that that year, but I know it's been five years, Yana. And you lived together in a house or an apartment, a condo? S several apartments. You were both signatories to the lease? To everyone but the last one. Why not the last one? Didn't want to be on the lease again. Who didn't? I didn't. So it was your apartment? Yes, ma'am. And how many cars did you have when you moved into the last apartment? Two. What kind of cars were they? One was a Ford Freestyle, and the last one was a uh, Ford Focus. In whose name was the first car? Mine. In whose name was the second car? Mine as well. And it's the second car that's the subject of these proceedings? Yes, Your Honor. When was that car purchased? July the 26th, 2017. And at that time, you had both cars? Yes. And tell me why you purchased the second car. I purchased the second car to help Ms. Mr. Atkinson get back and forth to work because the first vehicle, the Freestyle, was not working at that time. I had, um, was, was replacing the motor in the vehicle. Okay, so at that time, you didn't have a working car. So the only car that you had was the Ford Focus. Correct. And did you ever have the first car fixed? Yes. How long did it take? Couple of months, maybe about three or four months, Your Honor. It took that long because you didn't have the money, or it took that long because it took that did, long to fix it? It took them that long to actually fix it. I'd find another mechanic. Uh, I did, Your Honor. Right. Okay. Now, this is what the case is about. Subsequently, that car, that Ford Focus, got repossessed. Yes, Your Honor, it did. And you want him to pay for it? Yes, Your Honor. I drive semites and I drive 48 states. So I'm never really at home, maybe once every month and a half, two months at a time. And I'm there uh, a max of five days, if not shorter, period of time. Ms. Atkinson was responsible for the payment. Okay, fine. Mr. Atkinson, what I want you to tell me, sir, is are you still in the apartment that you were signatory to the lease on? Yes, ma'am. When does that lease expire? It actually got renewed this year in February. And were you and Ms. Siegler together in February? Not in February. I think we broke up about four months ago. Give me the month. Um, November or December? Right. November or December. Well, was, well it was, was it? Was, it was December. Around December. When in December? Middle, beginning, or the end? The end around the end of December. After Christmas? Yes. Did you exchange Christmas presents? No. So it was after Christmas? Yes, it was after Christmas. And tell me the circumstances surrounding you and Ms. Siegler breaking up. Um, now, look at me. Basically, basically, we just, we just don't see eye to eye. We get into a lot of confrontations, and it just got to the point where we just couldn't communicate anymore. So she moved out? Yes. There was no hostility at that point? No, just arguing and bickering back and forth, but nothing physical. Things okay over Thanksgiving? They were okay. Okay. 